I'm the calculus professor and today we'll be talking about logarithmic and exponential functions. In problem number 15, we'd like to evaluate the definite integral from e to e squared of dx over x ln cubed of x. All right, so uh, this is going to be a u substitution problem. And for this u substitution, I see I have ln of x sitting right here. And the derivative of ln of x is 1 over x dx. So I can use a u substitution on the ln x. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to say, let's let u be equal to ln of x, meaning that du would be 1 over x dx. And you notice I have a 1 over x dx sitting here, so that's perfect. So we can rewrite this integral as the integral of, uh, let's see, so the 1 over x dx all becomes my du, and on the bottom I have ln of x cubed. Well, ln of x is my u, so I have u cubed on the bottom. Now, e uh, I need to change my limits of integration because I changed over to u. e becomes ln of e. ln of e is 1. And e squared becomes ln of e squared. And ln of e squared is 2. So now we're integrating from 1 to 2 of 1 over u cubed du. All right, let's take an antiderivative. The antiderivative of u to the minus 3 is u to the minus 2 uh, divided by minus 2, or times negative 1 half, and that's evaluated from 1 to 2. Let's plug it in. I get minus 1 half times, if I plug in 2, I get 2 to the negative 2, which is 1 fourth, minus, plug in 1, I get 1 to the negative 2, which is just 1. So what we're left with here is we get minus 1 half times 1 fourth minus 1. 1 fourth minus 1 is negative 3 fourths. And so we're left with negative times negative is a positive, and I get 3 over 8. And so the answer to this definite integral is 3 eighths.